Yo, what's good, YouTube, man? Y'all know what time it is. Flex on them. It is episode number two on trying to go the whole season undefeated. Now, I am in a lower tier division, so I'm going to give you guys two fights each video. But as I climb up the tiers, I'm actually going to keep it at one because I just want to give you guys authentic, like 100% of me in these matches. You know what I'm saying? Win, lose. And then in the lower tier, it's going to be much easier for me to win. But GOAT 1099, I want to give credit to GOAT 1099 for this idea, for keeping it like really short with these. Uh, fights i don't want to spam too many fights i want to be locked in on one singular fight or two singular or two isn't a singular or two fights specific so as i climb up divisions i say once i hit 15 i'm looking for one fight man so y'all be looking out every day every single day i'm going to be dropping a video and we're going to be locked in and i will see how far we can go with this i mean we really got to be locked in on these fights so the commentary may not be the best but I will tell you this, man. The content will be A1. The fights will be A1. And in this fight here, I'm just trying to work Sean O'Malley's body. It's a three-round fight as well, so it's not five. And I think that's another reason to, to make it one fight. Because we'll be going to five rounds. I just want to be careful versus O'Malley. But you can already see. Look at, it, look at his body health. That's what I do to people, man. I really, I really take the body health away from uh, some of my opponents. I'm not going to say everybody because some people are much better at countering what I do. But if you ignore your body health versus me, I will consistently touch your body with the smaller strikes. And you'll be wondering how the hell did my body health get there by round two. Like I'm even willing to sacrifice taking a couple headshots. Right? To attack your body and these are the shots that are annoying these small ones right here that i'm throwing see how he's not answering them now i'm not answering his but I, he ain't really doing the work to the body like i am like i mean look at his body health already we've been in this fight for less than three minutes now luckily it's a three round fight and not a five oh i tried to pull back now he's trying to sway counter. Then slip counter. Okay. That means we need to utilize some feints. Oh, I thought I backed up. I didn't even block there because I thought I backed out of range. Sean O'Malley shooting takedowns. That's nice. You can see I'm really working right now. Nice high kick. Body. Nice. Watch out for the front kick, though. I do appreciate all you guys for watching, by the way, man. Uh, really, really, uh, like, means a lot to me, especially with, me, with UFC 4 being three years old. And you guys still support me throughout all this. You know what I mean? So, uh, shout out to the people that still around. Just know y'all support don't go, you know, unnoticed or unfazed. It really, I really appreciate it. But uh, lately, I want to be honest with you guys lately. And I'll explain to you more as we get into the next round. So lately, actually, before anything, I'm going to run an ad real quick. All right. If you get it, you get it. You don't, you don't. Here you go. Now, what I was saying was lately, I've been playing Street Fighter 6 Heavy. i actually been using this hitbox here. If you guys don't know what a hitbox is, basically, these red arrows are my movement buttons. And these are my, like, punch buttons. So on Xbox, on PlayStation, this one here is square triangle think of it like this is going to go across right this is square this is triangle this is r1 this is r2 and then this is x circle l1 and then l2 now i've been using this a lot because i've been playing street fighter lately and honestly bro i've been having fun i do plan on uploading some street fighter gameplay as he's spinning wheel kick fakes me all right i'm going to actually reverse this on the ground and not allow him to get up and i'm going to beat the living hell out of him yeah, you're reversed. Anyways, I've been using it on Street Fighter a lot. I do plan on doing Street Fighter content. It re I really would appreciate it if you guys, you know, support the Street Fighter 6 content. You got A lot of you guys don't support it just because it straight up isn't UFC. And I'll tell you this, bro. Street Fighter is fun as not only to watch but to play. And it's, it takes so much more mental on that game uh, than UFC 4. Like, I have to really be locked in on that game versus UFC 4. I can kind of lollygag, look at my other monitor and still play. 
stuff like that. I said I wasn't gonna let him get up. Ouch. But it's all good. Just back to backing up. That's fine. Okay. Back to working the body though. Nothing changes. Nope. The spinning heel kick ain't, ain't gonna really be there for too much longer. Really not at all. There we go. Nope. See how we got him conditioned with the body? Nasty combination. Two up top. Knock him down. Get him out of here. Or try to. Nope. 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 Come here. Throw the front kick for me. You got to be careful. Spinning elbow ain't going to work. Neither is that body. See how I can change the pace for me going, doing combos right back to me being. This takes a level of mental. It takes a level of mental being able to go to war for a second and then calm down. Then calm down and go back to, you know, fighting calculated. But we're going to go ahead and get this O'Malley out of here. Goodbye. There it goes. GG's. GG's, man. So that makes it 10-0. We're now 10-0 after this one. We're going to uh, actually jump into the next fight. And if you guys are enjoying this, do me a huge favor, man. Hit the like button for me. All right. Here we go with the next one. We got an opponent using Yawn. Now I'm going to O'Malley just to match it. But I think I'm going to do a series, right? And what I'm going to do is... This is on PlayStation. I'm going to do a series on Xbox to where I'm going randomized fighters only. I think I'll, so I'll upload, I'll try to upload every day one randomized fighter. No glove touch, by the way. And then I'll do another one with this one right here, where as you see, I'm trying to go undefeated. I mean, you guys can get some entertainment and some competitive at the same time. Switch stances. I want to land a quick strikes on this body. It's a little bit of a delay on this connection. It The ping was, the, was uh, 119. And I tried to back out. But I couldn't. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I just want to be careful versus Yawn. Nice. There we go. Body. Nice hook. I just want to be careful versus this dude, honestly. As you can see there, the lag spikes. I'm not... You know, people probably think, oh, you just complain about lag because he's losing. But if I'm lagging, I'm lagging. I'm going to say something about it. If I feel like I'm lagging, I'm going to say something about it. It's a three-round fight, too. And some of you guys may be used to fighting on lag, but I ain't. <laughs> I am not. Figured he was going to go something to the body there. Now, I have to be careful going uh, to the going up top with, like, a kick or something. Because I don't want to get caught. I don't want to get caught by something because of connection. And also, I'm O'Malley, so I want to keep it. Keep the fight at range. Nice hook. Nice. I had to block there so early in order to block that. This is actually ridiculous. Nice hook. Hook the body. Oh my goodness. One, two. I think we're losing this round, too. That was a nice combination. Gotta keep the fight on the outside. I have to. If I don't, I lose on the inside. As I continuously pop him with the 
with the one twos. That's kind of what I got to do here. Nice. I think you. I think you'll make a mistake by throwing like the high kick soon. I just have to be more patient. Look at this connection. Nice body shot. There it goes. There goes the high kick right there at the end of the round. It's a good round. Let's check the stats. So actually, I outlanded him, but he landed more significant strikes. So I think he won that round. Go round two. Nice. I don't even my fighting my opponent. I'm fighting connection. There we go. Nice combination. Caught him from a caught him from afar with the combination. Body. Oh, nice high kick. He goes high kick, then a hook every time. I'm noticing that he really likes that hook. Mm. Shouldn't, I shouldn't have shown that duck. It's going to discourage him from throwing the high kicks. Nice. Nice. Okay, he lands a hook. I land an uppercut. I'm fighting this connection so hard, bro. You guys don't even know. Threw the cross backing up and actually caught him. There we go. Okay. Nice head movement. There we go. The desperation. Oh, come here. Desperation will come out. I should actually try to freaking ground and pound this dude. Oh, there we go. Body up top. Back to the body. See how he's just standing there? Easy target. Back to the body. One, two. The high kick is coming. Trust me, the high kick is coming. There we go. We're going to walk him to the cage. I didn't even care. I just tried to throw him down to make him lose stem. I really want to take him to the ground. Come here. Bink, 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 bink. There we go. GG's. GG's. Ugh. That was a good fight, man. So that makes it 11 and 0 now. We're 11 and 0. 11 and 0. Respect for sure. 11 and 0 um, in this series here. See how far we can go, man. But I do appreciate all you guys for watching. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button for me. Also, subscribe up and turn on notifications, all right? And I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you.